AI is disrupting the creative industry and legislation will be critical in protecting ownership The Independent Uganda, by The Independent May 10, 2024 at 3.35 p.m. AI is creating new songs with voices of the likes of radio. Comment Julius Kyazze, pause for a moment and imagine listening to radio and a new song by the legendary, Kodongo Kamu, singer, Paul Kafiro, comes on. Kafiro who has been dead for the last 17 years. The song is off his 2024 album on which he has collaborated with Winnie Nawagi, Eddie Kenzo or any other artiste that appeals to millennials and Gen Z imagine there was an upcoming concert where you could go and watch Kafiro perform his new songs. The hysteria would be of epic proportions. It would possibly be the most attended musical event in Uganda ever. We live in a world where all this is possible today, attributed to the power of artificial intelligence, i. intelligence exhibited by computer systems. In recent years, AI has made inroads in many aspects of life. The leaps in AI development have been expedited by competitive pressure among tech giants and AI-leaning startups. AI's influence has not spared the creative industry. In fact, many have argued this is the field where human capacity will be replaced the most. One of the trending songs in Uganda now is Masavu, which features the late Mousy Radio and Azawi, one of the artists under Swang's Avenue's roster. AI created the song. Nothing best demonstrates the magnitude at which AI is redefining the creative arts like the case of Masavu. When the song was released, it prompted an obvious reaction within the public. Radio died six years ago. How is he featured on a remix to a song released in 2024? Good question. Chatbots have the ability to write a song, generate the melody and beat track, but most interestingly, emulate voices of today's popular musicians. AI can write a million songs or film scripts before a human finishes one. It can also create its own human-like images, photos and videos. You have to imagine what that means for screenwriters, songwriters, visual content creators, models, actors, authors, journalists and all other creative writers. As an entity whose core business falls in the creative realm, music, film, marketing, events management, music distribution and advertising, Swang's Avenue is alive to the reality that the ground is shifting. Which is why we have integrated AI tools into many aspects across our touchpoints. We utilize AI for data analysis and visualization for our events, to understand attendee data patterns so we are able to tailor future events marketing strategies. The latest edition of, Roast and Rhyme, the picnic style event that is about music and lifestyle, was the best attended we've had in all the nine years, with all the artists delivering electrifying performances and an enhanced experience for all attendees. This success is an outcome of analyses of the data from AI tools over time. AI is a $207 billion industry with an estimated growth rate of 37.3% over the next seven years. We cannot ignore such a movement. To position ourselves for the AI-driven future, we have had to dedicate team of interns upstreamed from the Swangs Academy to working on AI and content. This team engages in constant research to innovate new ways we can incorporate the tools in our workflow. The Swangs Academy has also expanded its courses to include talent management, event management and prompt engineering. Often protruding in the debate on AI are the voices that project woo unto those employed in the creative industry. If you ask me whether this renders the human psyche in the creative process obsolete, I disagree. Technology will not replace the human, whose ingenuity has stretched the possibilities of imagination and storytelling over the years. History has proved repeatedly that humans and technology can coexist and this is not going to change with I. However, every useful invention ever made has been abused in equal measure. AI will not be any different. For creatives, the gray area is impersonation and violation of intellectual property. Circling back to the hit song Masavu, one would ask, if AI empowers anyone with access to a computer to manipulate people's voices, lyrics or sound to make new creations that they proceed to earn from, what's the fate of the bona fide creators? This is where legislation come in. Creatives' intellectual property needs to be protected. Some countries are leading the way. 
The European Union, EU, has approved the world's first major set of regulatory ground rules to govern artificial intelligence. It is time Uganda formulated a law on the same. One of the arguments for reforms in the obsolete copyright law is that it law should address the influence that digital technology has on the arts. Government must appreciate that this is a critical industry, which has significant potential to spur economic and social growth. Julius Kiaz is the chief executive officer at Swangs Avenue, a pioneering talent management and production house at the forefront of integrating AI into the creative realm. Share on WhatsApp. The post-AI is disrupting the creative industry and legislation will be critical in protecting ownership appeared first on the independent Uganda.